All right, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, welcome back to Ultra Reacts. This is the last of my four I've done today. I did not know this was dropping. All right, okay, nobody informed me um, that this was coming. I thought JN dropped, he's gonna go off, and that was that. He dropped the great album, and you know, that's that. But no, we get this single called Unconditional, and I am so very excited because Roses, oh my goodness. Rose is going to be one of my most played songs of the year. That album is going to be one of my most played. Let's go back to Jay. Let's revisit, all right, since we are here. And it's been a couple, it's been like, you know, a month or two, whatever. Um, and let's just, let's just recap, all right? Because I got a big three now, okay? Well, actually, it's more than a big three. Because it's Smoke, Fantastic, Roses, one of my favorites of the year. Smoke and Roses is one of my favorites of the year. Can't Get You, Perfection, Easy, Perfect, Bro. So the man dropped one of the best mini albums of the year, and then he comes back on my mom's birthday, by the way, um, October 21st, and we get unconditional. So yeah, I don't got too much to talk about in this intro. Y'all know what it is. And citizens, we are in the building. As always, remember to like, and subscribe if you guys are enjoying the content. And as always, if there's a group of songs that you guys want me to check out, feel free to drop it in the comments below if you think I haven't seen it. If I haven't, I'll add it to the queue. All right, I had a lot of catch up on this week, so... Thank you. Appreciate it. Um, and yeah, let me know what your favorite, let me know your thoughts on Unconditional and the MV. I'm sure this is about to be something insane. I'm very excited. So let's go. Let's get it. Let's do this. All right. Unconditional. She's going and she deserves to be loved. Okay. 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 Yeah, now nah, let's get this. Let's, 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 let's get this right for the boy now. Let's get this right for the boy. This sounds crazy. Talk. I don't ever do this. I don't ever do this. Run that all the way back. Did I save the best for last? The West Coast feel too? This is real R and B. This is real R and B. How did this not make the album? Who wrote this? Who wrote this? By the way, this is all in English. Who wrote this? Did he write this? Did he write this? Did he write this? Did my boy write this? If my boy write this, his pin game is on. Oh my gosh. We got a couple quotables. We got a couple quotables. It was the boy's birthday two days ago, but we got a bunch of quotables on this one. All right. Oh my gosh. We still got two minutes. I still got two minutes of this. I'm in bliss. I'm in euphoria. This is, bro, how did this not make the album? I mean, I'm not mad. And it doesn't mean that it got cut, obviously, because it got released and it got an MV. But, like, I'm not complaining. But this is crazy, bro. I am. This is real. Me, me, real R&B is back. <laughs> 
This is crap. <laughs> what? What did I just come back to? We gotta have some NCT chaos thrown in. We have to. Top your camera away. Oh my gosh. NBA is fire as well. But this song is. <laughs> this is the second MV I've watched today um, behind Kiss of Life's Get Loud. Where they use the extras to do like different parts of like the chorus and whatnot. I I'm here for it. I love it. I love it. I love it. This is song of the year though. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. Definitely confirmation, early bias, whatever. Song of the year. This man dropped song of the year on like a Lucy. Just on like a random single. He dropped Song of the Year on a random single. You can't tell me. You can't tell me, bro. He's this is why he's my this is why he's the GOAT. This is why he's the GOAT. He's not the GOAT yet, but I mean he's got GOAT potential, I'm not gonna lie to you. This is bro. I don't think he needs to enlist. I don't think he needs to, I know he has to, you know, politically, you know, he has to enlist. But y'all can't take this away from us. I, I know it's only like a year and it's it's good, probably good, you know, and it's, you know, culturally fitting. But listen, he's, he, you see what this man is doing? I need this 365 days a year. I need this. All right. I need to be fed with music that sounds like this is good music. This is real R&B. Bro, this is real r &B. This could play in the States. Like, this could play in this. Like, I could throw this on with the, the, the boys in the, in, the, in the car. I could throw this on and it's right. Like, no problem. No problem. I could send this to, I'm about to send this to my mother. I'm going to be like, you got a birthday gift. That's how good this was. I did not expect that. I don't know why I didn't expect it when he's released some of my favorite music this year. Probably just period. I don't know why I didn't expect it. I said this on Smoke and probably Dan and and Roses. But his voice was made. He was tailor-made for R&B. He was tailor-made for it. So it wasn't surprising when Jay dropped and it was great. Um... Because he's, I mean, from the moment he debuted, he's been made for that genre. And when NC T hops in that bag, and it's great, a lot of the reason is because of Jayon's vocals and, and what he brings in his presence on the track, um, especially with an R&B, you know, in the R&B genre. So, that was, was oh, I got nothing else to say. In Citizens, we never not fed, are we? We're never not fed. Luckiest in the world. Jayon Unconditional, one of the songs of the year. Gotta be, without further ado, oh, show signing off.